Today I'm going to show you a feature I just added to PixelDojo.ai that allows you to take your text to video generations to the next level. To get started, really simple, just jump over to the Create menu, scroll down to Text to Video. In the Models menu on the right hand side, you're going to see a whole bunch of different options, but today we're going to go with Minimax. When you select Minimax, you'll see this character reference, and the description says upload a reference image of the character you want to animate. And just like the description says, this allows you to control the character that's actually in the video at the end. So, to start off, we're going to leave that off, and I'll show you what this would look like by default. So we'll start with a prompt that says, a woman walking down the streets of Tokyo. And then all you have to do is hit the generate button. This takes just a couple of minutes, and we'll see our video without the character reference. And here's a video that we get back. We'll go ahead and save this one so you can check it out in the gallery later. Now what we'll do is we'll upload a reference image. And in this case, I'm just going to upload this sort of anime style character. And you'll see the image uploaded here and you'll click the generate button one more time. And without changing anything else, we still have the exact same prompt. You'll see how much different the outcome. All right, and here's the video using our character reference. It's pretty spot on. It's pretty amazing, and it's even sort of got that anime-ish, sort of cartoonish look to it. So really, really cool. Let's try one more. We'll use this image from my gallery here. And again, exact same prompt. And here's a video with the new character reference. Pretty spot on. Super cool results. So now look, we're getting dangerously close to an era where you can inject your own characters into movies and television shows, things like that. Honestly, that's where this stuff is headed. But for now, you can have fun playing with these tools and use your imagination, see what you come up with. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or thoughts. Otherwise, we'll see you next time. Thanks.